does he get those wonderful toys? What is up, everybody? Moscatobot coming back to you once again with another video. Holy crap, you guys, we need to go. It's 8.46 right now, you guys. Uh, I have my SNES pre-ordered at GameStop. I was first in line. For those of you who follow me, you all know that. So we got that in the bag. That is fine. Now, here's the thing. I do have a second one pre-ordered on Amazon. I did that the night when pre-orders went up. The thing is, that's still like processing and stuff. It doesn't give me a release date yet or anything, a shipping date, nothing like that. It just says, we have your order, but it's going to take a while for us to get it ready. So I'm like, okay, that's fine because I only need one. Now, here's the thing. A buddy of mine wants a SNES Classic for me, and he was hoping to get it today. He's got to go to work. He's not able to snag an extra one of these. So I said, you know what, dude? I, I'm, I'm going to try, and I'm going to go out and see if I can get you one day one. So we're going to do a quick little SNES mini hunt at my local Walmart. Um, I have a buddy who works there. He says they got 20. They sold about 12 last night. I'm still not feeling well. I'm just, I'm not going to put my health at risk. I wasn't feeling good. I passed out at like 10 o'clock at night. Uh, and then I woke up again at 4 in the morning. I still was feeling like crap. But anyways, I'm going to go to run to Walmart real quick. It's right across from my GameStop. I'm going to see, uh, my buddy said they sold about 12 to 13 last night. So there's still a few there. If we're lucky, I get them a SNES and I'll just cancel my order. So that's what's going on. I just want to see if I can snag one. It's it's all for the fun of the hunt. I'm going to see if I can get another one. So stay tuned, you guys. Here we go! All right, you guys. So we are at the Walmart right there. I don't know if you can see, but we got Buddy Chan Chan waiting there. I'm going to try and scare him now and, and uh, see what happens. But Chan Chan's with us. Uh, he came here last night. He's the one who told me that they had 20 and stuff. So... I'm gonna see if I can get an extra one. Um, that way I don't gotta go through Amazon because Amazon treats me like mega poo poo. So, anyways, you guys, stay tuned. I'll see you in the store. No, no, no. Not seeing them either. Probably have to ask the back, huh? Yeah, they might. They might. All right. Walmart just gone. Completely sold out. Uh, this Walmart got 18. I am still in the Walmart parking lot. Scatterbot died. <clears throat> Excuse me. Holy hell. All right, you guys. So up to speed. This is my GameStop pre-order. There was six people in line for pre-orders, and there was 11 up for grabs, all right? So what happened was um, there was about six people in line. So I guess the next five people that go in can snag a SNES. I hope whoever wants one gets one. I was really hoping that GameStop was going to get like 30... You know, even 20 extra. 20 extra would have been amazing, but like, meh. so far, not so good. Uh, I tried to do a little hunt there and that failed. I'm too excited. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna go open this guy and I'm gonna put him on and I wanna play some Donkey Kong. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'll see you back in the game room. All right, I'll see, I'll see you back. I gotta, I gotta drive now. Hello, we're back everybody. All right, you guys, so got my awesome SNES Classic Mini Edition at GameStop. We got there about um, 9, 9.40, so we only had to wait 20 minutes outside. We talked amongst uh, the people in line and stuff. Talked to some dudes about the SNES Classic, you know, what kind of games were they hoping that were gonna be on it. Uh, I asked some questions on some of the videos that I've done before in the past there. Um, a lot of people want SimCity. Uh, I keep saying Turtles in Time. That's the number one game I wanted on this thing, but hopefully, <laughs> Something could be done about that. Hmm. Uh, anyways, but yeah, I waited in line, talked to some dudes. Um, like I said, my store, they had six pre-orders and 11 to give out. out so, uh, I'm happy that some people, uh... So like I said, you guys, uh, there was uh, two lines. 
Uh, there was only six pre-orders. I would number one. But yeah, two lines. So the six of us who pre-ordered were in the left line, and we got to go in first when the store opened because we had pre-ordered. And the second line had about maybe seven people. There was a total of 11 extras altogether. So those seven were guaranteed one. Um, I don't know if anyone else walked in after or not. But um, what was really cool is some dude who was uh, some truck driver who was delivering stuff really wanted this thing. He had some extra time. He stopped on the side of the road, put on his hazards, and he waited with us for the 20 minutes to grab this thing. So really cool. That's awesome. The guy was working, and he still got to snag one. So that's really, really cool. I'm happy he got his. Um, but yeah, everyone was cool in line. You know, uh, no one really wanted to be film or anything. And I kind of got that vibe, so I put my phone away. So that being said, uh, you know, I did get the clip of me actually like paying for it. It's uh, kind of blurry and stuff. I was first in line. I was really excited. I just wanted my SNES, okay? And I got it. I got it from my GameStop. My baby. My baby. So what we're gonna do, you guys, we're gonna go ahead and unbox this guy right now for you. I am going to compare it to the NES Classic Edition. Plus I put these old school dudes out here just for uh, obviously the video and stuff and they look cool, but it's just always fun to compare how small these dudes are. So without further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and unbox the SNES Classic Edition. Real quick, I'm gonna show you guys. There's the front of the box. There's the back of the box with all 21 games. Uh, you guys can pause the video right now and see what's all on there. I'm just too excited. I want to get right into this thing. But of course, your Star Fox, Metroid, Super Mario World, Zelda, Kirby, Mario Kart, uh, Secret of Mana, Earthbound, all these great RPGs that I've never played before that I'm really excited to play. Uh, I can't wait. Uh, we got those. So that's really cool. Side, side, top, bottom, me. <laughs> Oh, I don't even have any tape to cut. That's kind of cool. Don't forget the sniffer kids! Oh, yeah. Oh, there's some in there. Oh. Oh. Keep, keep the box, keep the box nice, keep it nice. Start with the boring crap first. Nintendo, instruction booklet. I know there was a poster in the NES Classic Edition, so I'm, just, I'm gonna see. Warranty, user agreement. Uh, I'm not, I didn't buy the uh, warranty at GameStop for a year. We don't know if these are going to be in stock for a year. They say they're going to be well stocked, but I'm not risking buying a warranty on that sucker. But I'm not going to get one. Uh, there you go, you guys. There's the instructions on how to set it up. All that jazz. I don't care about that. What I care about is this nice little, little poster here. It shows most of the games, you guys. It's really cool. Here, I'll bring it up to you. Kind of see better there. Cool that they gave you this. That's awesome. We're going to go ahead and fold this sucker back up now. Which I'm horrible at doing. There we go. The controller. I sure miss you. Put that to the side. Oh my god, it feels... It feels just like it did all those years ago. Oh my god. Just... There's the Super Nintendo controller, you guys. Awesome. Man, that... Like, I've had some knockoff controllers before, just for my Retron 5 and stuff, which still works great, you know, really cheap, but I haven't felt this kind of feeling since all those years ago with this controller, you know? I don't know where my controllers are for my, um, I don't know where my controllers are for my original Super Nintendo. They're somewhere in a box at my parents. I, I, I don't even think they're there. I, I, I don't know where they're at, so this takes me back, that feeling right there. God, that's awesome. There's one controller. There's two controllers. Awesome. Let's go ahead and move these to the side. Here's the uh, plug-in adapter. I'm just going to use the mini USB cord this time around, so I'm just going to leave that in the box like that. Keep it all nice with that. Hold on. Hold on before we get to the goods. HDMI cable. We need that. My... <laughs> My mini USB cord, we need that. Hook up in the back of the system. And now, the moments you've all been waiting for. Wow, oh my, oh my. Let's just, give me a second here. 
Oh my gosh. Oh boy. Look at that, you guys. It's so tiny. There's my ridge. Oh boy. It's like the size of a cartridge. Not working. All right, guys, let's give you a better close-up of the system here now that we got him out of the box. Um, what's really cool, you guys, is the power is the same. Up to go, uh, power it on. Down to power it down. Uh, reset. Literally resets the system. Uh, no eject. Obviously, they couldn't do that. No cartridge, which would have been cool to buy mini cartridges. Just saying. But don't do it, Nintendo. Do not, because... Can you imagine how rare it's going to be to find the mini cartridge of Donkey Kong or something? Don't. Forget I said anything. Don't do that. It'd be cool. Don't! Don't. No. No. Yes. No. No. Back of the system, you guys. HDMI slot. Mini USB cord goes in there. That's what powers the system. HDMI. All that good stuff. Here's the bottom. All that awesome jazz. Bang. What's really cool now, for the controllers, you gotta go from the bottom here, put that up, and then that kind of out and folds down. And that's where the controllers go. Let's try one now. And obviously, it's not this, the cord is not this long. It was for the NES Classic, but now we got an actual longer cord, which is good because that sucked. But yeah, just plugs in like that. I'm gonna take the plastic and stuff off. I'm gonna take the plastic and stuff off, you guys. But um, yeah, I, I got it out of the box. That is awesome. We're gonna go ahead and hook this guy up, and uh, I'm gonna play some Donkey Kong Country. I want to. Maybe we'll do Donkey Kong Country. And we'll do a uh, level in Super Mario World, and then that'll be the end of the video. So stay tuned, you guys. Stay tuned. Here we go! Oh, hello! It's -a me, Moscato Bot. Thank you for watching my video. If you like the video, please hit the like button for more videos on toys. Oh, so handsome! Give me on comics! Uh, for ass kicking video games! Uh, <laughs> then all you have to do is subscribe to my channel. Remember, Moscato Bots, till all are one. Moscato Bots, roll out!